What a catch of all Pokemon fans. Welcome to another Place Kit Games video. We've just gotten off this um, aeroplane and we're here in lovely um, Amsterdam, the Netherlands, and we're going to be going to the Van Gogh Museum for the Pokemon collaboration. I'm sorry it's a bit noisy, but very excited to be here and um, see all the cool stuff. Apparently there might be promo cards, exclusive merchandise. We'll do a little tour around the gift shop and show you a few cool Van Gogh paintings. Maybe I'll open a booster pack in front of the uh, in front of the sunflowers or something. That'll be really cool. But yeah, I'm just waiting for my, my um, travel friend Lewis to get off the plane. I'll see you in a bit. So we've just arrived at um, Amsterdam Central. We got on the train and greeted by this absolutely gorgeous view. Look at the look at this water and just like extending across there. And we we're already making friends with the where are the seagulls? <laughs> we're already making friends with the uh, busted locals, the, the native seagulls. Um, yeah, and we're going to head off to the Amsterdam Central. I'll take a look around. Um, what are you excited to do this weekend, Lewis? This this week, this day, Lewis? On this day, yeah. Um, get some tasty Amsterdam food. Some lovely like crepes and things would be nice. Mm. And then, yeah, obviously tomorrow is you know, Strube waffles. Yeah, yes. yeah. <laughs> um, very excited. And he's rocking the Gengar t-shirt, and I've got my um, Dragonite t-shirt. So yeah, let's 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 go for a wonder. <laughs> so this is the um, the view that we were greeted with when we, you know, we got off the um, got off got out of the train station. Absolutely gorgeous. Amsterdam's such a beautiful city. I'll show you this, uh, this little view from outside. Two Absolutely. hours later. We, we checked into the hotel room and Lewis is opening some 151. Let's see if, let's see if he gets anything epic. Yeah. Akma, Tigla, Dugong, Seekin, Dying Fossil, Cafe Bubas, Marowak. Marowak. I love the art on that, on the, on the, on that Marowak. It's so beautiful. But you wanted a big hit, didn't you, Lewis? So, so yeah. far you've opened 50 packs and you've not had to... What, one. But we have last pack, magic. Last, last pack of two magic. Last pack magic. So you've had a few decent hits, haven't you? I mean, yes. Yeah, so, I mean, in total, I've opened about fifty-ish packs. Oh yeah, yes, yeah. yeah, yeah. Got, got the Zapdos, got the Alakazam. Oh, you got the special Zapdos. Did yeah. Well, that's a big hit. It was a very nice hit. Ooh, Ooh but a free lap. The rest one's probably need Bill's trap. And ditto. I oh. <laughs> It's a, not what you want to see. Wow. <laughs> oh, there's a, we'll try again another day. <laughs> Time to nap. So it's the day before the museum opens for the event, and um, you can see we've arrived. Just arrived at Van Gogh Museum. They've got some cool um, Van Gogh artwork on the walls. It looks like they don't have anything related to Starry Nights because um, that's at like, the Museum of Modern Art. But um, yeah, I'm very excited to see you know what, what they have tomorrow. I thought also I'd show you guys whilst we're waiting for our tram. This amazing car here. It's actually wrapped in the um, in the sunflowers decal from the. Um, from the museum from the from the artwork which is fantastic look at this that's just that's just really cool i love that but yeah we're gonna go into town and get some food so it's the evening i've i've had my nap we had a look around the museum there's nothing to be seen at the museum yet but we're in um central amsterdam now we got this hello lewis <laughs> uh, we got this beautiful building there with a really cool like clock tower thing um we've got like church thing over there there's like more cool buildings around. There's like a crowd over there, a statue. This is awesome to be exploring. And of course, we wouldn't be here if it wasn't for that beautiful yellow rat, Pikachu. Shout out to Pikachu, my boy. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm gonna go and have a look around and get some foodage now. Right guys, so we're back at the hotel. We had a nice little walk around. We checked out the red light district, had some amazing um, barbecue ribs and a burger, I can't remember the name of the restaurant, it was absolutely fantastic. And whilst we were walking around, literally we were seeing this, this crazy street performer trying to squeeze through a tennis, a tennis racket. We got the information about the promo card. Um, so this is the Pikachu with a straw felt hat. I don't know how exactly what it's called. I don't have it in front of me because I'm talking to you. But this is the promo card and it's available at the museum. So the first people that will get it first will be the people that go to the museum tomorrow. Um, you have to do like a little, interactive like museum thingy you go around the museum looking at different pokemon and stuff collaborations so um if you see th this photo here you can see the ev smeargle um and the other the other things you can see that so you go around looking for the museum looking for these guys and then you'll get the uh, promo card once once you've had a little look around the museum and stuff so that'll be cool um good news and bad news good news for 
you lovely people watching this, you will be and by the time this goes out, you'll probably already be able to go to the Pokemon Center website and buy some of the new merchandise. So here's a, just a selection of some put some random merchandise here. You'll just be able to go to the Pokemon Center website and buy some of this cool merchandise, and then you'll get hopefully that promo card included with your order, Pokemon Center UK and the North America one. Um, and yeah, they look some really cool stuff. So I'll show you tomorrow. I'm gonna do go to the museum tomorrow and have a show you some more of the video later. Tomorrow as in today, with this video, show you around. But it's really cool for those that want to see it. But then obviously, I, you book the trip in advance. You don't know what's going to be here. Whether because like in Japan, there was two exclusive promos at the museum for the Scream Pikachu. Um, you could also got got the um, the Mimikyu. Um, at the the Munch, the Edvard Munch, the retrospective um, for the Japanese Museum, like five or six, five or six years ago, whenever that happened. So it's quite disappointing that, as far as we're aware, there isn't any other exclusive promo cards for going to the museum. But apparently, there are some exclusive merch at the gift store. So we're very excited to see what's what's in the gift store and how it compares to the the offerings that will be on the Pokemon Center website. By the time we wake up, the the website should be updated and we can see what merch is on the website as well. So yeah, very excited to go and see. Go and see the museum tomorrow, but now it's bedtime. Got the catch ball, so it's the morning of the museum opening. Um, there's a few people gathering around, but it's not not too crazy. I think now that people realise that the promo is going to be also be available on the Pokemon Center website later, there's going to be less people kind of going crazy at the museum. But there will be some exclusive things at the gift shop. So I think some of the key rings, maybe the fridge magnets, um, will be exclusive. So I'm very excited to see that. And um, we're just waiting outside under this like massive like alcovey thing. There's someone doing like kickboxing over there. Lewis is chilling out as well. <laughs> um, yeah, excited to, to to go in. It's a bit rainy. It's a bit cold, but yeah, got to catch them all. <laughs> so apologies for these. It's just some videos that I filmed for the, the um, for the TikTok and Instagram as well. Just some little. You know, um, outside shots, that's us queuing outside, and this is us when we got into the museum. I was very excited. We went to check in our bag first, and then. Um, oh, sorry, sorry. Yeah, and then we just. Um, <laughs> yeah, just, just getting into the museum. Absolutely beautiful inside the museum. Absolutely gorgeous. It's the morning of day one, and pretty much everything's already rinsed out. They are replenishing some things, like in the box over there, there's the plushes and stuff, but. Um, but um, other than that, like art prints are going, postcard sets, key rings are probably going, like it's absolutely wild in here. So we're in the museum now, we're just doing the, um, the cute little booklet to get the um, promo card, just kind of a little guided tour of um, around the museum, kind of doing questions and stuff. And here is the, the Pokemon stuff. So um, I want to show you guys like re close up of these, these look so cool. I'm going to show you these now. So over here is, um, bit of information about um, Van Gogh and his Van Gogh and his um, sort of life and pause it if you want to find out a bit more but um, so Van Gogh obviously inspires the artists in Japan so this um, one is obviously the promo card and this is um, by the lovely art artist Kimura and you can see here um, it's quite hard to tell but I had a close look and it, it looks like they actually painted these instead of like doing like a digital drawing so these are the actual original paintings I believe um, of the um, of the, of the Pikachu and the straw felt hat it's I'm just a great felt hat I'm so happy just to see this you know me being a Pikachu fan if you want to um, pause it please you know please pause it and have a look at that um, here, over here, you got the beautiful Eevee. So, so this is my, one of my favourite artists. Um, apparently, it's not pronounced Salsa; it's pronounced Soso. Um, and this is the one that um, we just saw downstairs. The actual we saw the actual picture painting downstairs. Absolutely gorgeous. One for the Eevee fans. Um, again, please, you know, pause there if you would like to read any of that. And over here, um, my other one of my other favourite artists. You got um, to Tomokasu Kamoya. Unfortunately, I got told off for being too noisy, or I can't remember recording something. I, I don't know what happened. But anyway, look at that beautiful Snorlax and the Munchlax by my favourite artist, Sal Sal. Absolutely gorgeous. One of the nicest things I've ever seen. I hope I can get one of the playmats of that at some point. That would be absolutely amazing. And above that, you have the Corviknight one with the um, with the birds and the sunflower and obviously the beautiful Smeargle. Moments later. So we found the, um, the, actual, the actual painting of the, of the Pikachu. There it is. <laughs> Self-portrait of the grey felt hat. Who wore it better? <laughs> here's the um, beautiful Sal Sal, and then you can see here the bedroom inspired, and there's the actual painting. Isn't that awesome to see the actual painting? 
So cool. So we're just having a little hunt around the museum looking for all of the, uh, the different things. Look at this, isn't this absolutely gorgeous? Um, we're just going filling in our little um, little booklets and sort of fun facts about Van Gogh's life and trivia and stuff. It's, uh, it's really cool. It's a really nice little experience. Great time to be a Pokemon collector. So it was really busy at that other thing, so they moved a bunch of the merch here, including the, um, the cool t-shirts, the, the colouring book. Um, they got a whole bunch of the beautiful postcards. They look absolutely beautiful. Um, nice set of pencils with the um, with the uh, with the sal sal design on it. Really cute, and um, the uh, the beautiful postcard, absolutely gorgeous. And then over here, they actually made a cute little um, statue. Um, Pikachu, Vincent Van Gogh, with the, with the straw felt hat, with the felt hat thing. <laughs> Isn't that absolutely adorable, guys? And then you see the collaboration with the. Um, with, with the uh, with the museum, I love it. Absolutely love it. So just in the queue, I've um, just got my um, booklets, and it's all it's the booklets all filled out, and um, we're just queuing to hand in the booklet to get the promo card. And there's just bunches of people just like sitting around, like filling in the booklets. It's kind of like you can see they're speed running the booklets just to get, just to get the uh, just to get the card. Maybe they've got multiple entries or something, or maybe they can go through the queue to to get more booklets. I don't know, I have no idea how they're doing it, but um, yeah, it's absolutely wild in here. There's probably like seven to eight times more people that would be probably here on a normal day. It's absolutely packed, so many people here. So we filled our booklet in, um, handed the cart, handed it in, and then we got the beautiful Pikachu with grey felt hat um, promo card. Absolutely glorious. Um, it's right up there with the Scream Pikachu in terms of like collaboration and artwork. Um, and this is also a Black Star promo, so people will need it for their Black Star promo collection. Obviously, it will also be available on the Pokemon Center website as well. But it's just absolutely very happy to have gotten this, and also to have actually gotten it at the museum and you know gone around the museum and actually you know done all the, filled the booklet as opposed to all the people that are just copying copying the answers over there and just going run, rushing through to get their promos. So yeah, very very happy with this, and um, you can see it's got the usual. Um, sort of barcode and barcode and stuff it's so cool so there's a queue that extends all the way back from those behind those escalators and it goes all the way over here to where the um to over there where people i think can both collect okay the left hand queue of the two is where you can collect the booklet and the right one is the long one is where people have been are handing in their um are actually handing in their things so um a lot of people have just been collecting the booklets and copying the answers and then speed running them and some people apparently have been able to pick up multiple booklets to get multiple promos thankfully i don't have to go that crazy thankfully because it'll be on the pokemon center website in a few hours but um yeah absolutely wild this is a cue just to hand in the booklet to get the promos you're right guys so we are back on the streets and we just went to after our first visit we just went to uh, mcdonald's and uh, starbucks um and a nice little pub um they had a pool table won my game let's go let's go um and yeah now we're heading back to the museum for our second visit this time because we already know the answers we don't have to go all the way around the museum to fill in the little um, booklet to get our second promo card so that's cool and then apparently a few hours from now most people are predicting the the merchandise um, on the Pokemon Center website will drop. What we don't know yet is whether the minimum spend, how much money you have to spend, Van Gogh merch only or other merch, we have no idea yet. So hopefully we'll be back at the airport by the time that merch drop happens. And then we can get some goodies because the TCG merch was not at the store. It was only key rings, fridge magnets, postcards, some kids' t-shirts, pens, and a few other random bits like that. So the TCG stuff, the play mats, the sleeves, the deck boxes, um, a few other bits and bobs. I think the plush is both at the museum and on the website, hopefully. But the big one I want is that beautiful Sal Sal So So Snorlax play mat, the one with the with the room. It looks absolutely gorgeous, doesn't it, guys? Look at that, isn't that beautiful? Um, and then if you see here, I also got to see the actual bedroom, the painting that inspired the uh, inspired the, the play mat as well so that was that was a good time yeah nearly back in the museum going for our second entry let's go 
So this is just the uh, view when you come down the escalator into the sort of main entrance of the museum. You can see all the people there, they're still queuing to get their booklets, to get their special card. What I love is that there's this massive sort of LED thing at the back which kind of just rotates different artwork from Van Gogh's sort of ma main masterpieces. It's really cool, very cool to see that. Um, yeah, and I think there's, we're getting back into the queue. So very excited, you can see, yeah, it's changed. It's changed now to that cool little forest one. Um, yeah, very excited. One eternity later. Hey guys, so I'm back here in the UK. I'm not sure when the last time I updated the vlog was, but I'm back here in the UK. Um, had an absolutely fantastic time at the Van Gogh, Van Gogh, at Van Gogh Museum. Um, just seeing the, pay, the, the the masterpieces in person was absolutely brilliant. Um, so happy to be able to pick up my, you know, my promo card in person. And um, we had a great time with my friend Lewis. Um, yeah, just very happy overall. It was a fantastic experience. Um, a few personal things didn't go my way, but that, that's that's another story for another day. But overall, highly recommend the trip. Eat, you know, you're going to get your promo for attending. If you go early in the day to the museum, um, there's a chance you still can get some like the exclusive key rings, fridge magnets, some other stuff that wasn't on the Pokemon Center drop that happened in the other day. It was absolute chaos for all the Van Gogh Van Gogh Museum stuff. Absolute chaos. Didn't get any of it. Very sad about that, but that's fine. Um, please remember, if you enjoyed the video, remember to leave a comment below. Um, you know, what was which is your favourite painting of the you know of the various paintings from the from the museum? Which was your favourite painting? Um, let me know below um, in the comment section. And please remember to like that video, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you very soon, Pokemon fans. Gotta catch them all. Thank you to these lovely people. They get exclusive market updates, Japanese buying guide videos, how to grade your cards directly with PSA and all sorts. Please click the link below and check out the PlayScape Games Patreon and I'll see you very soon Pokemon fans. Gotta catch them.